It's funny how people imagine that eating fruits and vegetables, grains and beans is going to be hard. And they end up doing something that really is um, 50, 60 percent of what you eat is carbohydrate. And if on a keto diet, they take all that away. So you're not having any grains, no more spaghetti, no more bread, no more potatoes, no more rice, no more cookies, no more cakes, all that stuff. But it, you somehow feel like you're doing something. Um, and because you've taken away more than half of what you eat, you're going to lose weight. Over time, what happens is that you get sick of it and you've been damaging your body um, in that interim with these high cholesterol, high fat foods. So we don't use ketogenic diets at all for anybody. And what we strongly encourage people to do is after they've gotten sick of having done that for the third or fourth time, um, try to go to a completely plant-based diet. The problem with the keto or the, the one of the bigger problems with the keto approach is that it makes people memorize a lie. 